Oh my right? gosh, and is mine gonna way, look like that? What is that? <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Clever Style. This is about to be one of the most exciting and scariest videos we've ever done because today's video is all about doing something a little bit intimidating i'm not gonna lie we're collabing with the one the only brad mondo a complete hair master it's exciting because duh it's brad mondo um it's scary because we're gonna try to follow one of his tutorials and then he's gonna react to us but i'm excited because i love learning new things especially when it comes to like doing my own hair my own makeup you know what i'm not that nervous necessarily i want i want him to be honest don't hold back you know give it to me give it to me like you gave it to jojo siwa that sounded really inappropriate i feel like it takes like school and practice and years of perfecting hair to like get as good as somebody like brad mondo oh you know what maybe He'll react and I will learn something. Cause I'm here to learn. I just pulled up Brad's video called Curling Iron Hacks to Style Your Hair Better, Faster, Easier. Here we go. Hi beautiful, <laughs> you look incredible. Thank oh. you for being here today. He's so cute. <laughs> I'm like adjusting my hair. I'm like, I feel like he's looking into my soul. We're talking about one of the most magical, glorious, fabulous tools to ever be created for hair. Can you make my hair look like it is not currently falling out via really old hair extensions? Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and try the first curling technique, which is for this blown out beachy wave. I'm gonna try his first one, but before I do anything, I'm gonna put a little heat protectant oil in my hair so that he doesn't yell at me when he sees this. Cause I'm, I mean, because I do this every time. <laughs> you know, any brush will do, but I like this really cheap plastic one from Target. I'm going to be using my Chi curler. I don't have the fancy springless iron. I have this one that I got from Costco. You think you know how to curl until you watch a professional do it and then you're just like, wait, what? So Brad, can I call you Brad? Feast your eyes on this. Ah, can you see that? And if you wanna know my deep dark secrets, I have started putting clip-in hair extensions on top of my sewn in hair extensions because I am a train wreck. Choo choo. We're gonna start off right up here and we slide it down and curl up. And we work our way towards curl the ends up. until we hit the bottom. All right, I gotta start over. <laughs> so here we go. Curling. We're curling. Oh, we're smoking. And curl I'm up. so directionally challenged. I don't usually go to the tip. I thought it was supposed to like protect the tip at all costs. That is a springy curl. Oh my right? gosh, and is mine gonna way, look like that? Doing oh. Okay. All right, I gotta pause it just to make sure I did this right. I mean, right? That's kind of how I curl my hair anyway, except I don't go all the way up and I don't unravel when I come out. So, but I also don't get the results I want. I've never held the curler like that. I don't even know if I did it right. I mean, like this is how I used to curl my hair when I was a year ago. So he goes up and he kind of holds the curler up too. Wow, that's really interesting because I usually curl like down. He said to let it sit. Okay, so we let it sit, we let it cool. How are you? What's going on in your life? We can brush it out. Now I'll be using a Mason Pearson. Wait! I love Mason Pearson brushes, but I'm not quite there yet. Brushing. What is that? Why did that happen, Brad? So I kind of like that these are coming out so nice and clean. You see, like really nice and like, there's nothing like attached to it. Moisture in my hands, cause I'm sweaty. One time my dad thought I had a hickey on my neck and it took forever to convince him that it was actually a curling iron burn. Why is it so short compared to the rest of my hair? Well, I haven't back combed it yet, let's back comb. Oh, how do I have so much hair? Is that back combing? Is it because I don't have the expensive brush? Okay, so that's a fail. Already you can see like a big difference in just like the shape of curl versus what's currently going on. <laughs> I'm gonna now watch another technique and see if it's any better. I'm gonna switch to the other side now and then I'll do some other like little touch-ups. 
Okay, we are higher. We are high. Ouch, ouch, we are burning. I know I've said this a billion times, but I usually curl it like going completely down. These curls are already way more my preference for sure. See, that's already like changed the way I'll probably curl my hair now for the rest of my life. We're gonna brush it out with our Target brush. Gently, brush it out to reveal. Oh yeah. I probably should have used a clip. He did have a clip. I didn't follow that stuff. I probably should have. Sorry. That's what I'm talking about right there. This one's still not like brushing out with as much body. Oh, maybe it is. If I fling it. Okay, I think I'm like pretty much curled for the most part. I really just like the way these look right now. These are like kind of nice and fun. What else are we doing, Brad? I'm ready. Now they're all cooled down and this is gonna give you that amazing kind of blowout wave effect. Mm -hmm. This is what you're going. Chunk of hair like this, curl it a bit, just like one time around. Leave that to and, and drop it out gently. Uh. And ends, curl it up once. I can't, I can't figure this one out. Curl up once, drop, three seconds. Once, drop, curl. Once, drop, curl, three. Once, drop, curl, three. Once, drop, curl, three. I like to really get my hands in there because you do have moisture from your hands and using that moisture to pull out the curl is always great to give it a more relaxed feel. R wrap, once, drop, curl, three. I already forgot. And we're just gonna gently back comb it. This is gonna give it a bit of volume. It's gonna give you- <laughs> All right, we curl it once. We hold it. One, two, three. We drop it out. Bigger, sexier hair blowout look that I am trying to achieve. Why does it look like that? I'm gonna need more moisture for my hands. One, two, three. We're gonna drop it. Dude, my neighbors think I'm crazy, I swear. We're just gonna, it's just gonna come out. Okay, well that looks a little better. Working on it until you Okay, see all right, it okay. It's perfect. It looks like an earthworm after a rainstorm. I mean, it's like, I've kind of done it. Like, I don't know, how, I don't know how to brush it, but I'm gonna keep working this. Oh my God, okay, all right. That looks really good. Right, it's like something's happening. Okay, so I like these waves so much. I'm gonna do that on the rest of my hair. Should I blame it on the brush? I kinda wanna blame it on the brush. <laughs> that looks great! Brad, what do you think? Brad, Brad, what do you think? I can't hear you. Can you speak a little louder? Brad, what do you think? So I think after watching it and seeing that it's not really like a brush, it's more like gliding the brush along each section of curl, that it helped a lot and it definitely gave me some of that volume because that's really all you're doing is you're just trying to get volume. This is the final result. It's not bad. I think that now that I kind of understand a little bit more about this whole backcombing situation, it does kind of give me that like floofed, that floofed look. This is awesome. I feel like a changed woman. So one, thank you for teaching me how to hold a curling iron properly. Two, I'm terrified of what your review is going to be. All right. Well, now the only thing left to do is um, let Brad judge me. So I heard Lauren and Sinead followed one of my tutorials, my curling iron hacks video that I made and they did it to their own hair. I just hope that when people follow it themselves, they they learn a lot. Maybe it still doesn't come out good, but hopefully better than what they could do before watching my tutorials. I'm about to find out. I'm gonna watch Lauren do it first, and then we'll watch Sinead. Let's do it. Show us, Lauren, show us how it's done. Okay, so I'm gonna try this first one, but before I do anything, I'm gonna put a little heat protectant oil yes. on my hair. I mean, because I, I did it. That. I don't have the fancy springless iron. I have this one that I got That'll from do. Costco. So Brad. I love that iron actually. Can I call you Brad? Feast your eyes on this. Uh, okay. Yeah. Do that. that and if you want to know my deep dark secrets, I have started putting clip-in hair extensions on top of my 
sewn in here in extensions because I'm a train that. wreck. We're curling. She has good technique curling. already. Oh, I thought it was supposed to like protect the tip at all costs. No, go to the tip. Like this is how I used to curl my hair when I was a year ago. So this is totally fine for your hair to look like this at this point. It's all about brushing it out. It'll look right once it's all brushed out. I promise. I hope. I think I did it wrong. Pull it. Okay, so here's the thing. I knew this was gonna happen to her because extension hair curls very, very well and it really grasps onto that curl. Those curls were very tight. It's gonna take a lot to kind of settle those down a little bit, but it could be cute. Just take a blow dryer and kind of stretch your hair out. Is that back coming? Is it because I don't have the expensive brush? Okay, this and is then good. Blue. That, that looks good. She did a good job. Iron. Those are beautiful. Just Thanks. shake it out. Shake it out. Oh, yeah. Yes. That's what I'm talking about right there. The thing is, I know she's kind of like, this is a lot. This is These are very curly. Maybe put the curling iron down to a lower heat setting or curl it or wrap it around and pull it down really quick so that it gets rid of some of that wave. Waves tend to fall out throughout the day and just get really relaxed, so it'll be fine, all right? One drop, curl, three. Ru I already forgot. All right, we curl That's it close, once, but three. Drop. We drop it out. Curl it. Oh no. Oh, yes. And then, yes. then what? We go down? No, 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 don't go down. It. Why does it look like that? All right, I'm gonna try this again. We're gonna have to work on your technique, Laura. <laughs> These look really good. Okay. Oh my God, okay, all right. Ah! Those look amazing. Wow, okay. I like I'm it. such a good teacher. That looks, wow. Do your whole I'm going to do that on the rest of my hair. That looks great. Brad, what do you think? This is so good, Thank Lauren. You. Wait, that was like the best I've seen somebody do their hair in a long time. Their own hair when they're not a hairstylist. Like that was talent. Oh my God, Lauren, I'm like really proud of you. Aww. That was brilliant. That drop down method is perfect for your hair and your hair length. You did a great job with that. That's actually the hardest method I feel like is dropping it out, curling, dropping it out, and you nailed it. Awesome. 10 out of 10, honestly. That's beautiful. Let's see how Sinead did, because which is much shorter hair. And curler. Okay, Operating good size. I don't know why, but something about watching people follow my own videos like makes me cringe. Please, please be able to follow it, please. Wait, yeah, it drop comes. it out. That Come on. Ah, that was beautiful. That was so right. I love how serious she is about this. This is great. I'm I'm very proud. She's letting She's it sit for a long amount of time. Maybe like a little bit less time would be good just because you don't need it that curly, but. You see, like really nice. Those are like, great. One time my dad thought I had a hickey on my neck and it took forever to convince him that it was actually a curling iron burn. Uh, was it? How do I, how did I do wrong? This is gonna be very curly, very go? extra, and I am so here for it. It's usually like this kind of motion. That's great like, too. The reason why that's happening is because when you curl under like that, you're getting a lot more volume at the root. When you curl to the side like this, you're getting more of a flat curl and not a lot of lift at the root. See, that's already like changed the way I'll probably curl my hair now for the rest of my life. Very I'm interesting. So I'm impressed. I but love this volume she has going on. So trip. exciting. I hope I've made you proud. Are you are. Proud. He did have a clip. I didn't follow that stuff. I probably should have. It's all about the clean section and just start from the back, go around the perimeter, and then do the center after. That'll help you a lot. It's got a good bounce to it, which oh, is yeah. important. It's bouncy. I hope. I really just like the way these look right now. These are like kind of nice and fun. Too. But that little model head looking hot AF. So <laughs> I'm gonna try it now. This looking hot as fuck. This is gonna give it a bit of volume. It's gonna give <laughs> I'm like nervous. Next year. Right? It already looks good. Don't. Ah! The back combing is hard to get. Hands. It really is. I mean, it's like I've kind of done it. Like, I don't know how, I don't know no, if I can just stop like, back combing it. It looks fine, it looks good, it looks good. Right, it's like something's happening. Should I blame it on the brush? I kind of want to blame yeah, it on the just brush. Do <laughs> I like don't think- Definitely that brush was a bit wide for this. Um, try and do something a little smaller because your hair is short. So you can also use a comb. Do a little back comb. You don't need to back comb though. If your hair already has volume like yours does, not necessary. I approve that. 10 out of 10. Oh my God. You had great technique. I think just a little more experience with 
with the flat brush would be good. But otherwise, I think you have great curling iron skills and I am very proud of you. Sinead and Lauren, you guys killed it. Thank you. Even if you didn't trust me at some points, I hope you could maybe just learn a thing or two that you would have never tried before. And if you did that, then I'm happy, which it seems like you did, so I'm happy. That was awesome. Thank you so much to Brad, who is an absolute hair magician. Like, thanks for putting up with whatever that was. If you're here because you love Brad, welcome to Puffer. Thanks for being here. Be sure to check out some of our other stuff because we do a lot of crazy, crazy things all the time. Also, click over here because I'm sure there is something very exciting happening. Like, maybe... I don't know, should we do a part two of this? Huh? Maybe part one is there. Maybe part two is there. Oh my God, I don't even know. You're in the past. I'm in the past. You're in the future. Wow, I need to calm down. Okay.